Alright everyone, how are you doing? So today's lawn cutting video is going to feature the 1995 Ryobi 700R once again and I'll post as well as this one here the 1999 Lomboy 10260 with a uh, 4.5 horsepower Tecumseh motor. So without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so this will be a little cold start. Uh, finally, the weather's improving. has been very nice for the last couple of days. Uh, <laughs> it seemed like the weather cannot make its mind. First it was raining, then sunny, and then so forth. The cycle continues. So, without further ado, hope you enjoy the video. So, we'll move this out of the way. And hope you see. Here is the Ryobi 700R, 31cc gas trimmer. The only reason why it smokes like Philip Morris is because it runs on a 32 to 1 mixture, so it's the same uh, mixture that I use in my lawn boy. It's a little more oil than usual because um, it's good for two-stroke engines, so that way it will lubricate all the cylinders and uh, longer engine life. So not bad for a... Uh, now 16 year old trimmer. I keep it nice and clean. Alright now for the lawn cutting portion. That's the uh, Tecumseh engine, four and a half horsepower, uh, easy start system. I believe it. Alright so now I'll put some gas and uh, see if it will fire. He's all gassed up and raring to go. Uh, pump it a few times. And uh, she'll fire first shot. Oh, maybe not. issue of the carburetor cleaning so uh, looks like we won't be using this one I'll have to uh, take out the carburetor and clean it that sucks all right replacement engine is 1987 long void 
So I did notice one problem, maybe you guys can help me with it. As you probably saw, when it was starting to conk out, I had to let go of the bar and uh, press it again to prevent uh, cranking the engine. Sometimes it conks out just like that, but starts up fine. So what I'd like to know, is there any fix to that? Alright, so uh, let me finish cutting the front again and I'll uh, speak to you in just a bit. The grass is done. It's probably uh, 9 p.m. It took around an hour and a half to do all 10,000 square feet. So the next time I do the grass, you guys are going to choose uh, the lawn equipment uh, for the next lawn cutting video, which probably will be uh, five or six days from now, not a week. So, I uh, have a choice of uh, these trimmers here. Uh, the 2003 Shandaiwa Home Light Zip Start model. Weed Eater XT600. The Mighty Light, the FS70 RC. Uh, these two don't work. The FS38. Those are the only working gas trimmers that I have. And a lot of lawn boys. So, I have uh, 84 4630. The uh, 10401C, the 5126, that works, 10247, 5269G, uh, 7073, 5277, that one does not work, uh, this, the engine doesn't uh, run anymore, I don't know what's wrong with it. Uh, the 10201, I have to buy some uh, muffler bolts, because my muffler cracked. And, see, this one here is a BP75AR rally. Problem is that the height changer broke down, so it's very hard to cut the grass with, with the machine. And, Sleeping Beauty, uh, Makita battery-powered lawnmower. And, of course, the electric one, but I have to do some modifications to it before I can turn it into a mulcher. So, come to a consensus of which lawnmower and which trimmer you want me to feature for the next lawn cutting video, and that'd be great.